again. So today I'm going to do a book review and the book I'm going to review is called How to Hang a Witch. And it's by, oh, I was about to say the main character's name. It, and it's by Adriana Mathers. Adriana? Adriana, sorry. It's by, and it's by Adriana Mathers. And I thought it'd be appropriate to read this book in the month of October because, you know, all the, like, Halloween themes like you know Halloween stuff such as like witches um, ghosts yeah that's everything that's in here magic spells yeah so this book is about a girl named Samantha Mathers and throughout her life she believes to be cursed because whenever a person got close to her bad things would happen like they would always get injured uh, one day her dad mysteriously falls into a coma so her and her stepmom moves to Salem and when she goes to her first day of school a group of girls called the descendants and yeah they don't like her at all because for starters her last name is Mathers. Mather is one of the key people who um a long long time ago her great 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 several greats uncle gave the okay to hang the alleged witches and the reason why they're called the descendants is that their ancestors were hang during the witch trial and they also noticed that once she arrived to Salem a lot more people started actually dying and that's another reason why they don't like her. When Samantha moves into her house she notices that a lot of things are like missing, uh, misplaced and she later finds out that it's a ghost trying to kick her out. Later on the ghost we find out that it, his name is Elijah and he helps her try to break this curse and by Doing so, she believes that if she breaks the curse, she will also help wake up her dad that's in a coma. I like this book because there's a lot of mystery in it. You don't know who or what is causing this curse or if there really is a curse, huh? Um, yeah. There's a little bit of romance in it. It's not too scary. There's a lot of suspenseful moments that I, I just have to like, um, like close a book and like, just like think, okay, okay. Is this too intense for me? Okay, let's go back reading this story again. Um, so yeah, there's a lot of those moments, um, intense moments. And I found out that there's going to be a sequel to the story, and it's going to take place in the Titanic. So it's going to involve all the same characters, and they're just going to move to the Titanic. I don't know how that's going to work out. So fun fact, the author um, is actually a descendant of one of the people that were in the witch trial. I would strongly recommend you guys reading this book. This is a good Halloween book to read. So yeah, that is it for this book review. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, everyone!